Okay, so this is how I use my um, instant lifting serum. I apologize that the lighting is not the best, but it's nighttime, so I'm using artificial light. But what I do is I take a couple pumps. Mine's almost empty, so I'm gonna try to see how much I can get out of here. You don't really need too much with it, so I got a little bit on my fingers here. I like to use my ring fingers, and I get the product on both fingers here, and I just gently apply it in a patty motion. I like to do underneath my eyes here is one of my most favorite areas to do, and I like to do on top of my lids just to get more of that tightening effect. So I just pat it into the areas, those lines underneath the eyes, and I can feel right now it's tacky, which is how it's going to feel, and then I like to do it on my forehead as well. I'm gonna try to get a little bit more here. So then I get a little bit more. And then I just press it into those problematic lines. So I'm using a good amount of force just to make sure I get it in those lines where I want it to be. Because if you can get the product into those lines, it's gonna help fill those lines and then cause those lines to look more firm. If you're just wiping it on, you're not getting the product into where it needs to be. And then once I get my product everywhere that I want, then I take my fingers and I just lightly do like a patty motion with my fingers, a quick patty motion. I'm gonna do it around my eye area and then gently on my lids. This helps stimulate blood flow and this is gonna help encourage that product to get where it's supposed to be. And then within, usually within about 10 minutes, the product's gonna start to take effect, sometimes less than that, sometimes a little more than that, and you can have results up to 10 hours. Me personally, I get results up to about, I would say seven to eight hours max, I'll have results with it. And already I can start to feel like a tightening sensation. It feels a little bit pulled, a little bit tight, it tightened around my eyelid area. Don't feel it quite yet on my forehead. Um, the areas where the skin is um, a more loose and you have thinner skin like under the eyes, you're gonna feel a little bit more and you'll probably notice more of your results in areas where the skin is thinner. And areas like the forehead where you have thicker skin, the muscles are stronger you may not get as exaggerated of a result um, and it may take a little longer for that to take a result. So I will notice a smoothing of my forehead, but it's not quite as dramatic as it is around the eye area with that skin being um, a little bit thinner. But I really do like this product and I think it works really well. I do find that less is more you want to use, not a ton around the areas, the problematic areas. And then just make sure if you are using makeup on top, Go light with your makeup and try not to do too much rubbing of that because that can affect and that can make your makeup come off along with the product. So if you're gonna be wearing makeup on top of the Instant Lifting Serum, I say at least give it a good 30 minutes for it to completely dry and to start having the effect of the product and then you can put on um, foundation or your makeup products. I will tell you that like a loose powder foundation works best on top of it. If you're using something liquid or something that's creamy, it can, because you have to do more blending with a product like that, you can notice areas where it may pull or you can see edges to it because of the serum. So it is a trial and error um, with this type of product, but once you get down the way that you apply it and then if you're gonna do makeup on top of it, you will be very happy with this. If you have any questions at all, please let me know. I'm here to help, bye.